what's good guys I'm back in my bush I'm kidding so my camera is finally not like disgusting <laughs> uh, this week we're talking about name change <clears throat> um, yeah name change so I live in Illinois and in order to change your name from the research that I've done you need to have lived here for six months and it's a pretty standard process like most states. Um, you have to publish your name in the newspaper for a few weeks, make sure nobody objects to you changing your name. You can't have any kind of felony on your record within the last 10 years, otherwise you can't change your name. Um, you, know, you have to go through a lawyer, you have to go to court, you gotta pay some fees. It's pretty simple. Um, why not being simple? I, I haven't lived here that long, so I can't change my name until January, which is kind of a bit annoying, but it also gives me time to like prepare for it a little bit. Um, most of you know I will be changing my name to Marius. I mean, I don't, I think I'm gonna keep my middle name as Blake for people that know me as that. <clears throat> also, <clears throat> I thought, think maybe I might, I, I mean, I'm not too sure. I might have like a Nigerian middle name just to um, keep tradition with my family and stuff. But we'll see when the time comes and I'll make that decision. I'm gonna keep my last name because it's just, <laughs> I'm used to it honestly and I can't see really see myself being named anything else even though my family may not necessarily agree with my let's call it existence <clears throat> um, but yeah it's pretty simple it's nothing too complicated I know like um, a lot of people I mean I feel like um, we had a conversation in the like seven trans guy group chat a couple days ago where we were talking about one of the guys was thinking about changing his name but he liked his birth name but he was thinking about changing his name because of other people, you know. And I think, sorry about the noise, guys. I think as a trans person, as anybody like in this world, it is important that if you are doing something that you make sure that the reasons you are doing it are true to you, you know. So if you're going to change your name, make sure that you're not just changing your name because you feel like it's what everybody else is doing or it's what everybody else would want or for some other reason other than the fact that you actually want to i feel like that's the biggest thing you know make sure that your name is your own make sure that it is something that you love you are because at the end of the day you know that you change it that's what you're going to be called for the next however many years i mean i'm sure you can change it again i don't know what the limits are on name changes but like that is something that you are going to be referred to. That's something that's going to be on your mark, on your record for a while, for a long time. So if you're going to do it, make sure that you're doing it for the right reasons. You know. So if you like your birth name, whether it's a girl's name or it's not, I mean, look, I, in my personal opinion, I would say that you should just keep it. Because at the end of the day, whoever's going to misgender you is going to misgender you. And it doesn't really even matter what your name is. Now granted, in some situations people do misgender you because of your name but honestly i think that <clears throat> there are always like outside factors with stuff like that so you just if if you can take it i'd say take it it's fucked up but if you can take it take it like i go to work every day and i get misgendered on the rank now, granted in the last couple of weeks since i've been on t i've seen like a drop in that and i don't know if it's to do with maybe things are different about me i can't really say but <clears throat> It's well, basically what I'm saying is people or the people who are going to misgender you are going to misgender you and it doesn't matter what you do It's just kind of a part of life and so if passing is important to you and something that you plan on doing at some point You will pass enough for that to stop happening and if it doesn't even really matter to you then you know, that's just that's cool, too um, <clears throat> That being said yeah changing your name it's it's kind of a big thing and a small thing altogether. So make sure that it's something that you want. Make sure it's something that you're doing for you. Make sure you pick a name that you love and you can live with people constantly saying it. You know, if you're trying to pick a name, try to get like your friends or the people that know you, people that know you're trans or anything like that to start calling you the name. See if you like how it sounds. See if you can get used to that being your name forever. You know, because that took me a while. I remember when I first started getting called Blake and I got my best friend to call me that. <clears throat> it... I liked it, but it always felt like a bit foreign to me, even though, like, especially because there were some people who just wouldn't call me that, which kind of messed it up for me a little bit. So when I started getting called Marius and the people, the people that I did tell that I wanted to be called Marius, they stuck with it really good. And that just made me love the name a lot more. <clears throat> um, but yeah, name change, change name for yourself, do things for yourself.
fuck everybody else. I mean, obviously you have to take a little consideration sometimes, but seriously, do things for yourself and fuck everybody else. Now, that's pretty much all I have to say on name change. Um, I'm almost three weeks on stuff, and I will be three weeks on Friday. Today's Wednesday that I'm recording this, so I will be three weeks by the time this is posted. Um, as for if there are any changes for me, my voice has started to drop, which is cool. I had like a really bad sore throat for a sec. Um, I can feel like the vibration in my throat when I talk sometimes. Um, I should really do like a voice comparison thing at some point, but I'll probably do it when I'm about a month and stuff. Uh, but <clears throat> other than that, I am significantly more irritable. I get upset pretty easily. It's, it's kind of uh, it's kind of weird, but it's also quite manageable because it it goes as fast as it comes, which is awesome. Um, other than that, there isn't very really much that I've noticed that has changed but I'm not paying like super like attention or anything like that um, we'll see in a bit I guess <laughs> but that's pretty much all I'm going to say in this video guys thank you for watching and I will see you guys again next week bye